You're here because you want to know why cows are sacred or holy in India, right? Okay, before I go any further, I would like you to please subscribe to this channel, turn on the notification button, and you see this blue join button here? Please click on it to support my journey as a YouTuber. Please remember at the end of every month, I do giveaways on this channel. So in order to win gifts on this channel, you have to subscribe to this channel. You have to like, comment, share my videos, and yeah, you will be eligible to win gifts on this channel. So let's go into today's video. Why cows are sacred in India? So I just want to go into the main concept on why cows are sacred in India. I just don't want to beat around the bush. Let's go straight. I just want to go straight. So from the Hinduism, you know, perspective of the teachings of Krishna, you know, Krishna was born in a low caste, you know, family, a family that, you know, um, had cow. Um, the reason, the reason why Krishna decided to be born in such family is because he, he wanted to stop the slaughtering and, you know, eating of cows you know among um, the tribes and the villages at that time so he decided to be born in that family to stop the slaughtering and eating of cows so growing up krishna used to play um flute um, anytime he goes to the field okay so anytime he goes to the field to play his flute you know cows animals you know so many kinds of animals you know gather around him to hear you know the sweet melody he's playing from his flute so one day the villagers you know called him and then asked him how he's able to do that and they're just amazed they just want to know how he's able to do that, to play music for animals, to gather around him. So Krishna replied them by saying, it's love, okay, it's love. He plays his flute with passion, understanding, and he transfers his love through the music to the animals. So the animals enjoys whatever he's doing. So in that process when he was able to gather the villagers around because of this marvelous thing he did with his music his flute so he started teaching the villagers what they shouldn't do okay especially to cows the slaughtering the eating of animals and cows he told them especially on the cow aspect he told them that the best alternative for a mother's milk is a cow milk so the, 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 the cow is a substitute for a mother so they shouldn't kill cow cow is you know the reincarnation of you know human souls are cows so they should treat cows with love and compassion he showed them the waste of um, the cow can be used as fertilizers in their farm. The, the urine of the cow can be used as, you know, insecticide for the organic farming and so on. He told them, you know, the dead cow, the skin of the dead cow can be used for bags, for their clothes and so on. He showed them so many things, you know. Um, governing up around the cow in the Hindu you know scriptures you know it says the cow is a source of the creation of this world we live in so they believe in that aspect also so the cow is you know something dear to their hearts and um, some also you know worship the cow some some don't worship but they treat the cow well but some people worship the cow and you know some priests also recommend the drinking of cow urine um, they say it's a cure to some diseases so they recommend it and the burnt ashes of you know the cow waste is used for rituals in the temple you know sometimes you can see they have some some ash mark some ashes in front of their forehead yeah that's it so they use that for rituals in the temple they use 
they actually benefit from the cow from the milk converting the milk to butter converting the butter to ghee so many things so through all this belief and the teachings of krishna it has affected them to live a vegetarian life not to eat meat because they benefit from animals they get you know good products from animals so they believe in the teachings of krishna like the way you and i we have our separate beliefs they also have that belief that when they eat animals they are wasting their lives they're not going to benefit any good from the animal they are just wasting the animal they are just wasting their life on earth so that is their belief i just don't want to go so deep into it but i just want you to have the understanding of why they don't eat cow why cows are holy to them um, and then they also believe that the more you feed your the cow the more you feed the cow goodness um, will come your way good luck will come your way favor will be on your doorsteps for you because the cow is holy the cow is like their mother and so on and so on so i'm just going to draw the curtains down on why cows uh holy here i think you guys understand me and if i'm not saying this right please let me know in the comment section and correct myself next time um or maybe i can correct myself in the you know in the description so let me know in the comment section if i'm not saying this right and please don't forget to like this video share this video i'm here to give you more incredible and massive video um you're, you guys are going to enjoy this so don't forget i do giveaways on this channel at the end of every month and support me by clicking on that join blue button um to support my my journey as a youtuber and yeah i'm lucky sam and peace